so I'm just in Tifa. Um basically the car picked me up this morning at half past eight and it's now about half past nine and I'm at Heathrow Terminal 5 and I'm actually going to France with Bourgeois um, we're going to be going for three days and I need to find section A which is over there yeah um, so that's what's happening I'm really tired I had a really really good nap in the car um, I had a really fantastic driver sometimes the drivers are quite like dodgy like they drive really fast or they keep um, braking but he was really smooth so I had such a good sleep in the car and yeah I'm just feeling a lot more awake now I put my eyelashes on in the car I feel like I've got like little fluff pieces stuck to my eyes but yeah after first just to say I have never ever been in Terminal 5 before and it's actually really quiet and peaceful in here and everything's obviously really new and clean I like it here <laughs> I normally go to Terminal 3 because normally if I'm at Heathrow I'm going to Asia so yeah I don't really fly British Airways but I will be today I don't normally eat breakfast at this time but I'm thinking that I should get something because our flight is at um, quarter to 12 so really I'm gonna be in the air during lunch time so I might get hungry so I might just have like a panini or something definitely need to get coffee I think I might get a ham and mozzarella panini I've never tried paninis in Cafe New actually I always get um, Starbucks or Costa so I'm not sure or maybe I should get something like breakfast that you like a croissant or something let's have a look I've decided to go for one of those scones I've just asked them to heat it up because I need something hot so that's what I'm gonna get just got my coffee oat milk flat white and I got a scone and I sit to warm it up and she's put it through the toaster so I feel like I've got a tea cake now <laughs> but I actually like it like that so I'm not complaining and also I am incapable of packing light we're only going for two days really and this is my suitcase <laughs> oh gosh We are now at the hotel and honestly guys, this hotel is beautiful. I thought I'd give you a little room tour before I ruin everything. So here we have the bathroom, there's the toilet, sink, me, hi, <laughs> a shower and a bathtub. We also have a couple of bathrooms and oh, I, love, I do love a good pair of hotel slippers. Um, in here I'm guessing this is the wardrobes we have this little seating area and oh my gosh there's a Nespresso machine this is what I need because dinner is not until 8 tonight and I am so tired already and it's only 4 p.m. Um, we have a TV cupboards a desk I didn't even bring my laptop because I just wanted to enjoy myself and treat it as a proper trip instead of having to work. We have a little pool outside. Is that for swimming or is that just a little pond? I feel like I'm really like dumb. I'm being dumb because I've never been to like a ski resort before. I have a balcony and then we're going to go upstairs to... Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Look at that. They've literally got me moon boots. That is so cute because I don't have any moon boots. Um, Amy, who I was traveling with, she's got moon boots. So I was like, what am I going to do? No, oh, it's like a little thermal, a little beanie hat, hand warmer. 
a little tag with the itinerary on that is so cute and what is this it's like a little box of syrup or something or is it chocolates oh yeah it's a little box of chocolates there they're gonna be gone in literally 10 minutes <laughs> once i put this camera down um there's a fair mall oh it's a uniqlo one i, I actually brought mine because i knew it was going to be cold but they've actually gotten us a uniqlo fair mall and there's also a couple of balloons here uh what is a through here this is another bathroom i'm really confused i guess the one downstairs was a guest bathroom but i do have two bathrooms i'm guessing this is the ensuite then it is really warm in here i might have to turn the heating down i'm so tired my eyes are really red because i literally had how many hours sleep did i have last night i went to sleep at uh half past one and i got up at half past six so i've had five hours sleep uh, let's have a look in here i always get really excited when i go into hotel bathrooms i'm such a geek um cotton buds shower cap makeup remover pads and a manicure set um did i bring my toothpaste i think i did and then there's lancaster um sun protection I'm pretty sure this is from Bourgeois. I'm pretty sure the hotel doesn't give this away, um, I think. And then what is that? A, oh, just a little ladies set. This is cute. So I've literally got four bathrobes. So I've just fixed my face a little bit, looking a bit less greasy. I'm here with Amy. Hey. Look how cute she looks. Hi. She's got her little pink benefit hat on. We're just um, about to have a little ride on a horse and the carriage. It's actually so pretty here. Just come into a little boutique which sells amazing, amazing designer stuff. And the boutiques here are so cute. And look, I have my moon boots on because it's so slippery outside. So we have these pink boots on, I like matching. <laughs> oh my God, how cute are these little kitty moon boots? So cute, oh my gosh. I've just gotten ready because we're going downstairs um, into the hotel restaurant for dinner. I've just basically put on this shirt. This is from Topshop. They do it in a lot of different colours but I have the burgundy one. I have my black blazer on which is also from Topshop. Just the black jeans because it's quite a casual dinner. And then I just put on a red lip which is the Bourgeois Rouge Fabulous number 13. A lot of you guys always ask me what colour my lips are when it's dark red and this is the one and my eyes are so red because I'm so tired and then I basically have um, my mango sock boots on so quite casual but quite um, classy I guess it's quite a nice little outfit for dinner I believe well I think so the only thing about this hotel room is that there isn't a full length mirror so I can't really show outfits from head to toe I can only show you in these kind of mirrors but I guess that'll do and then my makeup is still my makeup from this morning it's actually lasted pretty well considering I've been in a taxi for an hour and a half and then I've been on a flight for two hours and then it was another hour and a half to get to the hotel from the airport so I'm actually pretty pleased with my makeup and yeah I'll take you guys to dinner with me I've not really vlogged much today um, just because I am super duper tired and I just feel awful <laughs> no, i don't feel my best so yeah we went on a little horse ride uh, that was really cute me and amy and then stopped off at some shops they have some really good shops here so i'm looking forward to exploring a little more tomorrow but i think that tomorrow we've got a back-to-back -back schedule of what needs to be doing uh back-to-back <laughs> -back schedule of um what is going to be done so I think we only have a couple of hours spare tomorrow so we shall see but yeah ring this one is from accessorize it's from the um said for accessorize collection and then these rings are just monica finada 
and then my watch is just Daniel Wellington and I have a spare hair tie here just in case I want to um, tie my hair up but yeah I love this shirt love it three for example right. what do you what do you take what do you do to try what do you like okay and then we'll make a special for a special one for you I'll be there to represent you, Stephen. And I'm looking for. Good morning. So I basically just asked for a coffee, but they've actually brought pastries, orange juice. <laughs> they've brought so much stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have some breakfast now as I'm getting ready. You know I gave in. Been waiting so long to feel it. All of these years, I've been listening. Are you all so numb? Good morning, guys. So we are at our first location and it's actually a helicopter or actually this is not a helicopter I'm not sure what these are called it's a bit like a pilot jet but we're gonna go on one of those <laughs> like you know but it is amazing look at this view <laughs> just wow I am actually blown away like this is bloody amazing This is the beat of broken hearts, is it all lost? We can go on again Cause you seem like you want it bad My head is spinning off the edge And I'm giving in way too fast, way too It's actually so ridiculous here, it's so pretty. We've just had lunch and we are now going to this igloo. Um, basically it's new makeup launches I guess and I ate so much I feel so sick. I have been feeling sick since the plane ride um, but I've been trying to hold it together um, but yeah we're gonna go inside. Hello! Hello. Just got on back to the hotel. I'm just walking upstairs into the bedroom, and I have a couple of hours before um, we leave for the dinner party. I am absolutely shattered. Um, oh, it's been a long day. It's been amazing, like bloody amazing. Everywhere we went, I was just like, oh my god, that is so like. It's literally like a postcard here, like everywhere is just so picturesque. Um, they've given us some new makeup, some of the new launches. Let's have a look. There's um, stick foundations. These are called Always Fabulous. There's a stick corrector, which includes three different colours. And then there's the um, lip pencils that we had a play with earlier on. Um, I have six different colours. Oh, <laughs> I've just like fallen everywhere. And then there's a mascara, but yeah, it looks a bit like a concealer, but this is a mascara. And I also have this one as well. This is a um, volume reveal. So yeah, I'm looking forward to giving this a little while. Look at my hair. I actually look like a crazy lady just because I've had my beanie on for the majority of the day to be honest because it was so cold and yeah, I'm just, I might just get into, well not get into bed but just lay here for like 
15-20 minutes and just catch up on whatsapp with my friends and family and then yeah start getting ready for dinner but i'm excited it's really nice to be with other people like other influencers from i actually hate that word like influencers i hate the word influencers like yeah um i'm yeah i'm still baffled by that word but it's really nice just to meet other people and speak to people from all around Europe and yeah it's it's lovely it's really really lovely but I shall just chill now and I'll probably see you guys in a sec hey guys so I am ready I basically tied my hair back because I've had it down all day and I can't be bothered to faff with it I've just got it in a little like a low pony and then I've just left bits out at the front and give them a little curl and a bit of um, texture spray I just used Bumble and Bumble's dry spun finish and I have this gorgeous black dress on from H&M it was in the sale and I got it um, a couple of days ago before I left and it's basically this black long dress but it has this drapey detail here and it is absolutely gorgeous and it kind of just see if I can show you here it's kind of knee length but it's like an asymmetrical hem and then look at the detail it's really nice and it's kind of got like leopard print on it but you can't really see the print yeah can't show you guys let's see if it's any better like this there we go so it's got kind of leopard print it's got a little bit of um volume at the shoulders and then it just drips down really really nicely and it makes my bum look bloody amazing let me show you look at my bum like the stomach area and the bum literally look snatched um so yeah i'll try and link it if it's still online but this is what i'm wearing tonight for the dinner party and i've just got my big manga earrings and this lip is actually one of the new bourgeois velvet lip pencils which won't be out yet but it should be out um, in spring and yeah I just love this it's really casual but kind of like classy I just think I've curled my hair a little bit too much it just needs to be wavy not curly so yeah let's see you at the party way too fast, way too fast. This is literally Aiden's heaven. There's Kinder Eggs and there's aeroplanes. I'm gonna get this for him. He's gonna love it. Hey guys, today is a Sunday. It has been um, two days since I got back from my trip. And honestly, I didn't vlog for the past two days. I was going to vlog and then finish off the vlog but I didn't vlog because I've just had the biggest headache ever literally for the past two days I couldn't even bring myself to unpack my suitcase um, but I finally did it last night because I took some tablets it was getting to the point where I was just like you know what I tried to stay off tablets because I don't want to rely on them um, but it got to the point where I just needed to pop a couple of Nurofen because oh my gosh the headache was just unbearable i actually had to just lay on the sofa basically and watch netflix because i couldn't physically get up and go out and i had to order takeaway which i'm not a fan of <laughs> i do like takeaways now and again but i'm not a big takeaway order person so if there is a possibility of like um having fresh cooked food then I would totally prefer to cook but my headache was just so bad that I couldn't even bring myself to go out and buy groceries to make myself some food so I just ordered 
takeaway last night and actually i'm really glad that i did that because it gave me time to rest i'm basically gonna make myself some food now because it is lunch time and i haven't eaten i've been up since half seven um and i need some food in me so i'm gonna grab some food i might be going out for an early dinner with my friend i'm not sure yet i'm gonna see how this video turns out and also i am just like when i got home i am so glad to be home obviously i am very very grateful that bourgeois took me on a trip with them sometimes i'm just like why why me like there's so many other beauty influence influencers and makeup people and like they've got a lot to choose from why did they choose me and i feel like i just need to stop being so <laughs> um doubtful of myself i am a very doubtful person just because i don't like to get my hopes high i don't like to burst i don't like to think that i'm you know at a certain level or whatever i'm just me like so when these opportunities come to me i'm just like forever i'm like what me why like like i feel honestly i feel so grateful and feel so lucky to be able to do this kind of stuff and call it work because like it's not only a hobby but it's a passion like makeup is i'm out of focus but um focus there but yeah makeup is my passion so it's it's honestly it's just unbelievable and i'm so grateful <clears throat> the only thing i would say was um i was very homesick just because this is the first ever work trip that i've been away from aiden i've been on holiday before without him for like five days i think at the most but i was with my friends and that was kind of a different environment um when you're with your friends you're more kind of like relaxed and it's um you know you're kind of in your friend circle bubble but on this trip i literally didn't know anyone and I think it kind of made me homesick a little bit um, because I'm a very um, comfort person so I like to stay at home, I like to be with Aiden, I like to do things with him like I'm not really like oh yeah let's do this and do that and be really adventurous and like I'm not that person at all so I yeah I'm just the everyday girl basically who likes to stay at home in my pjs and you know just get on with life but yeah i'm so grateful and honestly i'm trying to take on more opportunities like that um previously for like a lot of events and a lot of things to do with going away or being away from home i would say no just because um it was out of my comfort zone I am off out now. I thought I'd quickly show you what I'm wearing. Just before I leave, I have my hoodie on, which oh, honestly, I feel like I'm going to be living in hoodies because of the cold weather and they're just so comfy. I have my warehouse jacket on. Sorry if I'm out of breath. I actually uh, just have to go downstairs and then run back upstairs. Um, I have this jacket on which I put on my Instagram stories and so many of you guys bought it and I think it's now out of stock because it was really cheap. It was reduced from 90 to £35 I think it was and it's honestly so warm and cosy and it's a little bit different um, to the all black or all brown ones that everyone's wearing. This one's not as like common i guess and then i have my little chanel mini wearing black jeans because they're comfy and then my manga sock booties so yeah and i'm gonna have a h&m hat on i'll link everything down below but that is my outfit of the day <laughs> I'm just with a couple of my friends. We went to eat pho. It's really yummy. And now we are in Canary Wharf. Um, 
We're going to watch the lights. Kylie? What's it called? It's called Winter Lights. So basically, it's like a installation in Canary Wharf where there's lots of like illuminated lights outside. So yeah, that's what we're gonna go do. But my friend needs coffee first. So Alice is gonna get coffee. <laughs> I'm sure you've all seen her before. But yeah, you can get one from Pet. Yeah. Dishes on here. Yeah. Um, I've got my coffee because I lost them earlier and then went food shopping and I went to the toilet. So I had to um, do a quick detour and get coffee. Apparently these dangly things are meant to light up but I don't see that many lights. Like why are these not ones not working? <laughs> To this crazy dog and my duvet is still on the server because last night it was so clo close it was so cold that i just thought a blanket wasn't going to cut it and i brought my duvet out onto the sofa and i was watching netflix under my duvet because it was that cold i had my heaters on as well so i'm not sure why it was that cold i feel like london is just really cold today it was freezing <laughs> we was outside watching the lights and it was such a nice display and it was free as well so anybody could go and watch it and i think it finishes this weekend coming so if you want to watch it be quick because it's going to be gone soon and yeah i think i'm just going to take off my makeup and call it a night because oh i am tired i feel like I have a little bit of a headache again. I'm not sure what's wrong with me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to edit a video as well tonight. I filmed the last segment of my foundation review, which is this foundation that I have on my face. So by the time you watch this video, um, my foundation review should be up on this foundation. So yeah, I'd love it if you go and watch it because... It took me all day to film <laughs> well in different segments it was like during the course of one day but it did take me like separate kind of filming sessions so yeah i shall see you in my oh gosh that's not a flattering angle so yeah i shall see you in my next video thanks for watching this vlog guys and bye Mwah.